Good evening. Every teacher that has a pride flag in their classroom should be fired and arrested. The gay flag is a sexual flag. It represents nothing other than sexual things. Gay, lesbian, bisexual, transgender, and questioning. What business is it of anyone on this board of what children would like to do with other children? It is none of your business. It is between them and their parents. But however, you guys want to illegally survey your students. My name is Frank Rodriguez. I'm the executive director of operations for Gays Against Groomers. I'm a 31-year-old gay man pushing back against the agenda that's happening within our classrooms. Keeping parents away from this discussion is absolutely severing the relationship between a, a child and their parent. My community is not discriminated against anymore. Shockingly enough, we succeeded. Now you're sending out surveys that's asking students what their gender is, what their pronouns are, and whether or not you should be telling their parents. Could you imagine if my son or one of yours went to school and said, hey, I'm gay and you never knew? All of you up here are pretty intelligent. You have doctorate degrees, you're educated, and you lead this district. But yet, you turn a blind eye with the sexual things that happen in your classroom. I refuse to believe that any of you think that that's appropriate. Because if you think that that is appropriate, you would be a predator. There's images that are going to be displayed today for you to see of a child sucking another child off. And that's in your classrooms. I shake because it makes me uncomfortable to even utter those words to you. This is nothing about inclusion. It is nothing about respect to my community. I say with you with 100% truth, according to the Center of Disease Control, that the reason my community faces such issues in this world has absolutely nothing to do with the straight people on this planet. It has everything to do with the drugs that we digest. It has everything to do with our access to health care. The number one reason my community has so many mental health issues is because they don't have access to health care. And that's, the, that's directly from the CDC. It is not slurs, it's not gay bashing. It, we don't have access to therapy. If you really want to help the LGBTQ community to feel really accepted in this world, embrace that people have mental health issues and they should seek help. Having a classroom without the American flag in it is a disgrace to this country. If this country wasn't here, millions of people around the world would perish. And that flag, this flag, should be held high by every single student.